All right, Mom, go ahead and do the intro. What's the intro? The intro of the show. You know the thing that I say at the beginning of every episode? No. You have to talk, Mom. It's a podcast. No, I do not. Cannot remember. Hey, everybody. Welcome to Let's Die, the His vs. Hers Guide to the Apocalypse, the podcast. My name is Brett. It's your boy. Even away 100. Oh, rule number four, volume two, jars of peanut butter everywhere. She gave me life and she'll sure as hell take it back. It's mom. Say hi, mom. Hi. All hi. right, mom. Hi, everybody. Mom. What? So, you used to be on the show. We used to get alcohol and drink alcohol on the show. You didn't offer me any. That's why you're going to take a drink of this. Okay. It is Mega you. Mix. Miami Beer Company. Pale Ale. <laughs> it's not good. It's good. It's Ugh, good. It's not. Thank you, Miami Beer Company. I like fruity beers. So, Mom. What? You're my mom. Yes. And uh, you've been listening to the show for a long time now. All the shows. And we've mentioned you a lot on the show. Yes, thank you for the sh sh call out. Hi, everybody. Calls. Shout uh, out. And you gave me grief for wanting to be on the show and not being able to be on the show. Yes, last season. And now you're on the show. Yes, I am. I'm very happy. So, Mom. I'm the biggest fan. Okay, well, I was going to ask Number you. Number one you, fan. What do you think of the show? I like In some general. of them. I love some of them. And I don't care for some of them. Oh, okay. Well, we'll get into some of that. So, Mom, what I have prepared for you today is a rapid-fire interview. Do you yes. know what that is? You ask questions really fast, and I have to take time to answer it. Well, they're more like snap answers. It's <laughs> that not... beer's nasty. <laughs> You want another drink? No. It's in my mouth. Ugh. Um, so, I'll ask you a question. Okay. You're not allowed to have time to think about it. Three seconds? No, I'm not timing you or anything okay. like that. Just give me your first impressions. Okay. So, I got some practice questions. Shoot up. Shoot. Okay, here we go. What's your favorite color? Black. What number are you thinking of right now? Three. Was I switched at birth with another child? Yes. Okay. So that ends the practice questions. So you're more likely to tell the truth and what you're whatever's on the top of your head now. So here we go. This is the real interview. You ready, okay, Mom? Yes. What was the last thing that you ate? Meatloaf and rice with soy sauce. Are swords like katanas or clubs like baseball bats better? Which one's better? Clubs or swords? Swords. Who are you going to call? Ghostbusters. Also, you're wrong on the swords. The correct answer no, was No, I've been bats. listening to your wrong. podcast, and you're wrong. What color? And I'm tired of you talking over people, telling them the baseball bat it is, is it, but it's not. It is. Because you have it's to be strong to swing you the You don't bat. have to sharpen a baseball bat or pull it out of bone when it gets stuck. I'm anyway, telling you. Mom. Okay, what? What color is the sky in a Bruce Willis movie? Black. Incorrect. It's red. The answer is Red Dawn. What topic would you like us to cover next season? No clue. Okay. Oh, um, how about all different kind of zombie movies or all different kind of apocalypse movies? Well, we kind of do that already with apocalypse stuff. Well, you just some you movies. just kind of. I try to do a healthy mix of like video games and movies, and occasionally maybe a TV show or a Netflix. But they're thing. different kind of apocalypse besides just zombie. Right, and that's what we do. I don't want to do just zombie. There are a lot I of mean, zombie podcasts. You can't take a club to an alien invasion. A bunch of aliens coming down. It's not strictly for aliens. aliens. The club yeah. thing is for specifically zombies. Okay. Anyway, all right. Nothing like are it, you. Okay, you said movie. What movie would you want us to do a show on? What movie? I like The Quiet Place. The Descent. How are we going to do one on The Quiet Place? We would just be quiet the whole time. It was just such a great movie. The I mean, way, I was, the way I was to survive on, the quiet. I was like, oh my god, I can't There's stand no it. survival. Well, I mean, there's probably minimal survival tips. Have but you seen it? No, I haven't. Don't spoil it. Okay. I want well, to watch it. Maybe, maybe we'll do one next season. It'll be a lot of silence in the podcast. No. I mean, you can talk about the movie. Well, okay. then they'll kill us. Next question. Okay. What would you do if trapped in a time loop? If I was trapped, well, it depends what time it is. Today. Right now, and if I kept coming back here? Yes, like uh, Happy Death Day or Groundhog's Day, something like that. I just watched a movie on that time loop. Um, Avengers Endgame? That's not I would really pay attention. No, it was on Netflix, and it was this red-headed girl, and she had this long, crazy hair, and she was 
she kept dying over and over again. And she started paying attention oh, to the Oh, Russian things. doll. Yeah, and she started paying attention to the stuff around her. And that's what I would do to try to get out of the time loop. Okay. What's your first reaction when our dinosaur overlords descend from space? Holy shit! Are you like, are you saying what I'm saying? That's pretty good, Mom. Are the Reapers coming? They're already here. Okay. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Probably just one log. Best food for an apocalypse? Grass. Grass? Really? Green stuff. Can you elaborate? Green stuff. Green stuff is not just grass. Green stuff in the woods. Okay. Well, I'm blowing by it. <laughs> if you only had one book on a desert island, what would it be? If I only had one book. Um, the Survival Guide of Living on an Island. Is that a real book, Mom? It is. Look it up. Okay, I'm going to look it up right now. That's the book I would read over and over. Tell us about it, Mom. It tells you how to, build, how to build shelter, how to eat from the sea, how to keep sand out of your bathing suit. Is it really? Are you, are you messing with me? I'm just fucking with you. Okay, that's what I thought. <laughs> Ridiculous. Is there a real book that you would read? No, I wouldn't read <laughs> if I was deserted. I wouldn't on read. Island. I wouldn't read. <laughs> I'd be trying the, to survive. I would write in the sand. <laughs> I'd write my own book. I'd like, read that over and over again. Who is your favorite grand dog? Who's my favorite grand dog? I have many, many Okay, and dogs. which who's your favorite? They all have different personalities. Keep in mind, our pod dog, Tun Tun, is sitting at your feet. It well, would have to feet. be. Right under your chair, actually. Don't All hurt her feelings. of my granddad. That's not a correct answer. Are spiders scary? No, I've never been scared of spiders. What is the bird box? What is in the bird box? Excuse me. What is in the a bird? A bird is in the bird box? Yes. Okay. All right. Simple. What is the worst episode that we did this year? Or how about and then what is the worst episode that we've ever done? Is it could be one and the same. Um, I'd have to have a list. Sometimes I don't care about like Transformers. I just listen to that because it's informative, but I'm not a fan. Okay. Well, um, maybe we'll tackle that again later on in the episode. Uh, did you ask me what my favorite one was? Not yet. We're getting to there. Am I your favorite son? <laughs> yes, because you're my only son. Was Avengers Endgame a good movie? No. Uh, was it's I so a good, boring. Was I a good kid? Up to puberty. <laughs> was I the good son? No, if you're referring to that movie, absolutely I am referring not. to the movie. No, I'm not. really impressed. You you, I'm really impressed. You got that that reference. You did take your do your sister's uh, Barbie dolls and rip their heads off. And... Well, have you ever stolen anything? Yes. What did you steal? I can't remember. I'm sure I have. <laughs> As an adult? No. No. Oh. Finish this lyric. The Transformers. Oh, I did steal your dad's heart. Oh God! All right. Finish this lyric, Mom. The Transformers. Robots in disguise. Autobots wage their battle to destroy the universe. No, it's the evil forces. The of evil forces of the, the Decepticons. The dun, dun, Decepticons. Dun. Okay, close. You did okay. Not not bad. Who won the NCAA basketball tournament? I don't care. Fantastic. Will this episode have consequences? Probably. What's your anthem? My anthem. Would be just that Iggy song I just heard. <laughs> Iggy Azalea? Azalea? Yeah. What is that song called, Mom? Uh, I don't know, but it was pretty cool. Something about you, she went well, from she the says, bottom, now she fucked that, shit, fuck that, like, shit, fuck that shit, and now you love my drip. All right, Mom. Fantastic. What's your personal motto? Is it now fuck that shit? No, it's fuck it. Fuck it, okay. Fuck you, Fuck them. Fuck everything. Ladies and gentlemen, this is my mother. Uh, did you actually listen to every episode? Yes. Finish. Who? Him. No, okay. If you could Thanos snap away 50% of anything, what would it be? Fat, cellulite. Okay. You know, body fat. Who is your favorite child? Who is my favorite child? It'd have to be... You mean that came from me or like... Every, out of all the childs I met, children I met. Wouldn't the children that came from you have precedent over other children that you may or may not know? Maybe, maybe not. Well, who is it? Depends who spends more time with me. Whoever spends more time with me. On my podcast. Uh, you're in my space.
No, this is I my love house. You, no, honey. my space doesn't exist anymore. This is my I house. I don't have a favorite. That's not... Actually, I do have a favorite, and I tell you all my favorite when we're alone that you guys are my favorite. That is such a horse shit cop out answer. When I'm with you, you're my favorite. When I'm with Jasmine, she's my favorite. When I'm with Vanna, she's my favorite. That's. And when you're all together, you're all my favorite. That doesn't count. That's not a good, not an acceptable answer at all. I don't have a favorite then. <laughs> so you hate all of us equally. I don't hate any of my children. Mm-hmm. All right, mom. We're gonna take a real quick break, and then we'll be right back. Okay. You want to? Okay. The, you want to do the ba dump bump? Ba dump bump. No. I thought you listen to every episode. I guess those are more the commercials, but you ready? We're gonna do the do the haunter sting. The thing that's in between each segment. Mm-hmm. The dun 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 dun. I don't remember. Okay. Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Die. The his and hers versus nope. got the his and hers. No. Nope. Uh, for, I give up. His versus hers guide the apocalypse. his versus her guide no, to, the guy to the apocalypse. Welcome back to the podcast, everybody. I'm here with my son, Brett. He's Hi. invited me for this very special podcast. He's trying to pick my br- brain, which it's not going to work. All right, Mom. I got yeah. on me now. This is OBP Orange Blossom Ooh. Brewing Company. I'll try that. It is a orange beer. That's good. Well, then you can drink that. Damn, I was kind of hoping to get like a blah, another blah, blah, blah nation rise. Uh, Taylor brought me these uh, Florida beers. I miss her. Wait, hi, Taylor. Uh, hi, Taylor. She's on her way to Connecticut as we speak for her new job and new life up there. Hopefully you get to see her this summer. Anyway, Mom. Brooke. We're back after grilling you over various things. How now, about you let me grill you? Okay, go ahead. Um, what do you got prepared? Can I see the notes? I can tell you. Can I see the I notes? I have learned a lot about you. Mom, can I see the notes? Yeah, here's a note. Fuck you now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Mom. What? What are you going to ask me? I'm just kidding. Oh, okay. So, now, there's a reason why this episode is titled Mom Apocalypse Report Card. We need, we're going to go through every single episode. Okay. You said you need the list. Here it is. And we're going to get your general thoughts, so you don't have to go too far in depth. You can do whatever you want. Okay. This is your time. All right. So, and we're going to go starting from the beginning to the end, and then after the last episode, we'll go over the very special specials and stuff like that. So the first episode, 2-1, Jazz of the Dead, a sequel with Jasmine. That's pretty funny. What did you like about it? It was just funny. Okay. 2-2, two, two, Ali Apocalypse with Zoe the AI and Aaliyah. That was hilarious. Thank you. I've, I've heard lots of good things about that one. People seem to like that. <laughs> she just never got you and understands you like I would. You mean Zoe the AI yeah. or Aaliyah? Zoe. Ah. I uh, like Aaliyah too. Hi, Aaliyah. 2-3, uh, Uranus Can't Explain Us with Wes. <laughs> I can't remember what that one's about. That's like Greek Titans and... Yeah. Stuff like that. That was my. That was probably my least favorite one. And I was like, you know what? Screw it. Putting it out. Kim and Brett fall in love, perhaps Valentine special with Kim Burns. Yeah, you told me not to listen to that, but I did. So again, I learned a lot about you on that podcast. But that was good. I did enjoy that. What'd you think of Kim? I love her. Kim loves you, by the way. I was supposed to tell you that. Actually, she... I'm listening to her and Cat right now. Cat. That's what I just said. You said Cat. 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 Ketron. Ketron. Ketron Porter. Porter. Ketron Porter. Porter Ketron. No, Ketron Porter. Ket. Ket. K E T. No, K E T. That's what I said. No, you said Ket. K E T. No, I said K E T. K E T. Anyway. Ket. I'm. Since anyway, I was look, done listening look on, to you. Look on my Twitter DMs right here. Kim says right here. Um. Uh, ooh, ooh. She said, you're so sweet, and she loves you. I am sweet. But I love her, too. I love their show. Because I would act exactly like them. Okay, so that show is Kim and Kat Stay Alive, maybe? All right, what? where were you going with that, by the way? That's, I'm just telling okay. you, I like that I like that show. Okay, really. fantastic. 2-5, Podcast in Disguise with Chris. Yeah, Transformers. Oh, okay. 
Two point, I listened to it. It's okay. 2-6. March Madness Marriage Management with Savannah and Jacob. I like that one, too. You don't... <laughs> Are you lying? No. Are you lying? Cause... I, oh, what I did love about that was the special effects, because it was hilarious. You would press the button, and oh. the buzzer would go off, and yeah, I'd start I laughing. Meant, I meant to do more with that, and then, like, <laughs> half the time, I forget to do the stuff, so then it takes me a second to bring it back up, because I'm don't. i not exactly working with a sophisticated soundboard here. That's okay. I thought it was funny. Also, I think of funny things and then forget later. So that doesn't help. Um, also, Savannah's... Um, Sound quality is horrible in every episode she's ever in, forever. Like, I'm going to have to buy her stuff. Go ahead, buy it for me. I don't know. Well, i got to buy it for me first. What? I don't know. If we could ever get some traction on the uh, Redbubble store there, Mom, you know, if we had some... Why don't I just some, buy you a uh, microphone? You know, I'm supplying all these, these uh, this free entertainment, you know, people just... Just listen to it and, and, and don't help out, you know, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, buy me a, buy me a studio, Mom. I'm not going to buy you a studio. Back my uh, podcasting network that doesn't exist How about exist I just yet. Uh, scratch your back like Ow! That. I don't see you mailing people, like, um, uh, highlight reels to try and get us signed to a big-time network. I've got a network. great idea. I'm going to do flyers. Uh-huh. Put your podcast on that and your Twitter and your Redbubble and your Mom, I already have, already, we already have flyers. I don't see them pasted everywhere. That's because... They cost money. I don't, I don't want to put them just anywhere. You can find them at The Grind, a local restaurant here in one, uh, one St. Albans, West Virginia. It's a great restaurant. Uh, you can go there, play D&D or a board game or a card game, and get some really excellent food. Oh, excuse me. A burp. Not, not at The Grind. Ah, Mom just burp. I can do it loud. It's the beer. It's the beer getting us. 2-7. What's in the bird box with Wes? What's up, Wes? Wes, what's Where up with Wes? You? Wes, what's up? Oh, he's not here. Why did you? Why did you think he was here? It was a joke. I don't get it. Because every time I say "What's up, Wes?", he should say "What's up." Okay. What's well, up, Wes? He's not here. Well, on that one, um, I was actually arguing with you guys, but you didn't hear me. Noted. But I like that one too. Shimmer me this plant. Oh, two eight. Shimmer me this plant woman with Hannah and Jasmine. Loved it. Are they in a Pokemon world? Settle it. Jasmine and Hannah? No, uh, that movie. Shoot, Annihilation. Natalie Portman. Who's in what movie? Like they were po like they had Sawsbuck was in there. That the all the animals they were like Pokemon. Oh. They had the alligator guy with the shark teeth. That was like a Toto dial or no? They weren't in Croconaw. the movie. No, yeah, and then vicious. the bear guy was like a big Ursa ring. No, you're wrong. They yeah, were, they were in a Pokemon are cute, world. And you could rub their Not belly. All of them are cute. And, well, and no, but live action snubble is a nightmare. Animals in that movie were scary, so okay. no. Two nine. Super Bandersnatch Brothers with Wes and Jasmine. Briefly Jasmine. She was terrible in that. She aggravated me. <laughs> that was okay. That was okay? Yeah, because I didn't watch the movie. Okay. Well you really should. 2.10. This podcast will have consequences with Zoe. Not the AI, the person. Yeah, I listened to that one. Okay. He's uh, an artist. Who's an artist? Zoe or Nick? Nick. Nick is Nick an artist. Is. No, but I listened to the last one with Zoe and Nick in the Transformer one. And Chris was in and that Chris. one. And Chris. Way to be forgettable, Chris. Uh, Arach 2.11, Arachnopocalypse with Deva. Loved it. What did you love about it? I like spiders. I was taught you kids never to squish a spider, to catch it and let it be free outside. What'd you think of Deva? I love Deva. Smart and intelligent, and she's saving the spiders. <laughs> 212, assuming direct control of this podcast with Zoe and Chris. What one was that about? That one was about the Reapers and Mass Effect. Oh, yeah. I listened to it. It's okay. I don't play Mass Effect, but I listened to it. Oh, okay. 213, Into the Anthem Verse with Jasmine and Wes. That's Jasmine's baby, so if that one wasn't good, that's on Jasmine. Well, again, it's a gamer podcast. No. Nope. Which, it's a game. We do games, but we're not a gamer Well, I podcast. don't play those games, but I do listen to them so I can understand the game when you're talking to me. Okay, well, here's another one. 214, Podcast Combat with Jasmine and Savannah. With Mortal Kombat. Right, that's what it, that's the joke. Yeah. Well, I love that one because all three of my kids are on that. Absolutely loved it. Okay. You sure about that? Except. There we go. Jasmine was right. We were terrible at Mortal Kombat, and you could kill us in like two seconds. 
<laughs> I just button mashing is all it is. Well, we button mash and we didn't get nowhere. Mm hmm. Let's see. What was. Oh, I can't tell based on this. Never mind. Um, okay, 215. We dare to be stupid with Nick, Zoe, and Chris. What's that about? That was Unicron. Oh, yeah. I just listened to that a couple days ago. Okay, I liked and? it. I liked it. I learned a lot about Transformers. That's a glowing, glowing review. Uh, a lot of laughter like, in there. Yeah, it's I a, listened to that. It's a good group. You got a lot of good banter. I listened to that. A lot of laughter. That. You guys have good chemistry. We just joined PodCoin, and Podcast Combat is our most listened to episode, by the way, with 24. So, that's not bad after having just joined it. That's a lot for just a couple days. We're not a big-time podcast, but... Pretty cool. So I guess popularity wise, although I'm sure I did see some analytics. Um, you know what? What? That's just the Podcoin app. Let me check. Uh huh. Let's see here. Who had the most plays? Looks like Jasmine. Nope. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh. A very special after school special. Goblin ears are a girl best friend. 341 plays. What? Hmm. That can't be right. That's the most popular episode? It's bizarre. I'm going to say people didn't like that one. R regular episode, I guess it's, it goes to Aaliyah with 300 plays. So, Aaliyah Apocalypse, the AI episode. Followed closely by Uranus can't explain us. Oh, what a bad episode to follow us up that up with. And then Kim and Brett follow up one, perhaps. What are we doing? Oh, uh, what did you think of the very special after school special medieval RPG? Is that where Alexa? Yeah, no, that's the one where I was the narrator, and we took turns deciding. Is stuff that between... what Wes and Jazz? It is. That was boring. Oh, okay. Well, you kept re it was like you were reading a story. There weren't more m much choices that your callers could pick. I mean, you would read ten minutes of a story and then yeah, let them choose it gets something. a little long winded, so, and that's just the parts that I let. I mean, slip the only through. funny part was you missed a whole two paragraphs and then went ahead and far in oh, the no, story. I, I did that a lot. I did that a lot because it you're gets like, oh, real I guess we're, we're dead. And there is a lot of uh, world building that I just skipped right on over. Yeah, what about at Assass Jurassic Nick Revealed? The second of which is called uh, Jurassic, Scat, Jurassic Scatman Revealed. I kind of like wish that. they were longer so I could hear. What? Actually, that was funny because the computer kept asking you the same question over and over and you would answer. That's kind of the allure. Wait, wasn't that one you were dead in? Oh, wait, they kept calling you a different name. She kept calling you a different name. Oh, because the character you're playing as is some guy, and then every time she would say that guy's name, I'd say, my name's Brett. Yeah, that was funny. What about the After Dark Rye crossover episode, Pokey War, with Hannah and Wes? I loved it. Lies. You didn't listen to it, did you? I, what, well, you gotta refresh my memory. I listen to a lot of this podcasts. This one right here, see? Oh, that's the one where Hannah and Wes were in a pokey war against each other. I think I listened to It's like to a that. game. Well, what a glowing review from my mom. Mom! Wow. As we're winding down here. Oh. What do you think of the season overall? I enjoyed it. I enjoyed your guest. enjoyed the topics. What? On a scale from 1 to 10, what do you think? I think it's a 10. Lie. Boo! How do you think we can improve? You can improve by quit jamming down everybody's throat that you need a bat during the apocalypse. I don't want really to do that at all. You do. You it's not, re not a real criticism. You don't want to uh, bag on our sound quality. Or, oh, um, I couldn't hear. Or the scattershot nature of the I show and the fact that we don't do much preparation. The sound on the Transformer Unicron one, I uh -huh. couldn't hardly hear. Was it Chris or? I couldn't hear one of the guys very good. Uh, but anyway. I don't know. I'd no, have just to keep what you're doing. I'm enjoying all of them. All right, who is your favorite guest? I have several. Nope, you have to, you can only pick one. Doesn't mean you dislike anybody well, else any less. this is Brett's world, so I've got several. No, you I have like. to pick one. I like. Only one. Mom, don't, don't play with me. Okay, me. <laughs> 
Who do you want to see return the most? I like... Other than you. There's several people I would nope, like to Nope, just return. one. Give me one. I'm not going to give you Mom, one. and that one person will guaranteed be on, on next season. Me. If not the first episode. No, I said other than you. Oh, other than me? So they'll be either the, other the first me. or second. Okay. I want more... I, I love Kim. Uh-huh. I think she's very funny. Mm -hmm. So I like Kim. You're going with Kim? Yeah, but Jasmine's a regular, so and Savannah's a regular. I consider them regulars. Okay, well... Wes is a regular. Well, if you want... I'd like to see Taylor back. Well, we're, we're getting there. Um, is, so, Kim, final answer? Yes. Okay, Kim, if you're listening, if you're interested, we'd love to have you back. That's not totally up to me, Mom. I, I can't know. I can't strong arm Kim into doing this, this crappy little show. I know. And she does it. She did that first one out of the goodness of her heart because she's a sweet thing. And I like I like all your um, guy friends. I think they're funny too. Okay. Well, thanks for not hurting anybody's feelings. Well, you know Wes, Nicodemus, uh, Chris. Um, there's another one. Where's another one? I'm trying to help you. Anyway, I enjoy your shows. Fan. Fantastic. Most of them. You forgot about Hannah and Zoe. And Hannah and Zoe. Zoe's the other girl. Um, let's see here. Who do you dislike the most? Because they will never be back on the show again, ever. You can't dislike anybody. Nobody's mean on your podcast. Too bad. Who's your least favorite? Because they're never coming back. Who is ever. In the least? interest of making the show better. Never coming back. Never. Well, Ghost Cat's kind of quiet. When you talk to her, she don't talk back. What Ghost Cat? The Ghost Cat outside. Ghost Girl, she was never. She was in like one little commercial thing. Well, there you go. Oh, wait, no, she wasn't even in that, I don't think. I don't have an answer for that because nope. I enjoy everybody. Pick, pick one person because they're never coming back. Well, then, um, nobody. It's not an, it's not I'm an not answer. I'm not picking. You can't make me pick. You can pick yourself. All right, I picked myself. <laughs> all right, y'all heard it. Mom's never coming back. Um. All right. What are your thoughts on this episode? I probably sound like a chipmunk. And and I have to listen to it. I since you listen to it. Okay. Since you well, you were here for the recording of this one. What do you, how do you think this one's going to turn out? How do I know? I'm not listening to it. On a letter grade scale, just like on a report card, what do you give this show as a whole? I give it a six. Out of ten? That's brutal. Wait, it's letters. I said letter grade, and oh, you gave us grade. a six. I give us That's a... That's awful. On a letter grade? I give us a B plus. A, B, C, D, E, F. We got an F, everybody. You heard it here first. I got Ladies it. and gentlemen, Let's Die, his reserved podcast. I give Mom a, disapproved. Have, F rating. Don't tickle me. I give it a B plus. Too late. We got an F. Oh, okay. Mom. Brute. If you want to hear more of my mom, check out the Venom episode from season one. Uh, very special, after school special. Uh, shit. Say something. Me? No, the other person that's in the seat right beside you. Oh, uh, um, what are you having on for next next season? <laughs> I don't know. What are you talking about next season? I can't talk about that. That's proprietary information. Uh, a very special after school special, FSAS Monsieur Venom. Uh, she's on that. Uh,. Check us out on Twitter at Let's Die Pod. Rate and review us, please, on iTunes. It helps out a lot. Redbubble.com slash people slash Let's Die. Check out our other show. It's all about Pokemon. After Dark Rye. That's A-F-T-E-R-D-A-R-K-R-A-I. Oh, my God. And, uh, yeah, next show. Next episode. This is the last one. But then the next one's going to be another special episode. Um... Be a sort of a clip show with me waxing nostalgic upon the show itself. Uh, thank you to everybody that's ever been on the show, all the guests. We've talked about you all enough. Thank you, everyone, for listening. Um, sorry, Mom, that you'll never be back on the show, but I appreciate you being on today. Um, well, if the people want it, I will be back. Nope, that's not how it works. You've exiled yourself. You Thanos snapped yourself. If um, I am the most listened to, they want me back. 
Oh, okay. I will tell secrets of the host. Yeah, then you're definitely not coming back. Well, they won't be secrets. So, since this is the last real episode, we're going to take a break. Uh, just like last season, we'll be gone for a month or, well, like two to three months. Um, you can expect, you know, hopefully better sound quality, perhaps a more structured show, yeah. but probably not. Maybe it'll be funny, but probably not. Uh, there'll be an, expect an announcement in July sometime concerning... Volume three, season three, whatever you want to call it. Thanks, mom. Thank you for thank you everyone for listening. Thank you, mom. Mom, do you have any last words? No. Okay. Well, mom. Well, we're... yeah, I do. Okay. All right. Just want to thank everyone for listening. My son is very funny, and he's very cute and handsome too. Wonderful. Well, mom, there's only one last thing, and if we're going to die. Let's die together. No, we're not going we're not to die because you're my mommy and this is a happy we're ending. We're not going to die together. This is a happy ending. To yeah. We're going to love no, together. I'm trying to bait you into saying together with me. You want to try one more time? Yeah. We're not going to die because you're my mommy and this is a happy ending. Together. together. Oh my God. <laughs>